Hey, what is up guys? True Power Shad here, bringing another episode of Inism 11 Go 3 Galaxy Pyro Paradox. Last time we left off, we defeated Xanarch Domain, as you guys requested, and today we're going to be fighting Hackleton Junior High. Now, before the actual match begins, I'm just going to say a few things now. Um, I'm very sorry there has not been a video since Sunday. I mean, uh, there's two reasons why I haven't uh, recorded a video. Um, the first reason is that I've been pretty busy with school stuff now, as a matter of fact, I do have quite a fair amount of homework I still need to do, as well as revision for exams and stuff, but, um, I'm gonna get around to that another time, um, later today, sorry. So, um, yeah, I've got that to do, as well as the fact, um, some stuff has just been affecting me emotionally and morally in real life, and it just, I didn't, I didn't really feel like recording, just because I wasn't, like, I wasn't really my, I haven't really been myself for these past few days, but I'm starting to feel a whole lot better. Now, just because um, some stuff happened, and um, I might talk about it in the future, but I don't really want to talk about it now. It's just, um, you know, just stuff. Yes. But, um, yes, aside of my life stories, which I might talk about, some other things I've done. Um, let's go over the new character I have scouted. The QR code for this fantastic player has finally been released. Yes, that is right. I am talking about... Uh, I feel like I want part... Oh, wow. We were just on him. Huh. Mutsuka's at Tema, Mixie Trans with Arthur. This Mixie Trans has finally been released. He looks pretty damn cool. Um, I'm not going to use him. <laughs> just because I put way too much effort into training um, the Tema I use. Where is he? Where is he? The normal Tema. And uh, I really cannot be bothered doing that with this Tema because of the fact that I do have um, updated my game so I don't have the uh, patch. But the cool thing is that he. Um, when you recruit this time, you get Margin Pegasus Arc, oh, which is pretty cool. Let's um, just get it off him now. I just recruited him. I recruited him yesterday, but um, I didn't really do anything. Um, yeah, so that's all I did. I literally turned on my 3DS, scanned that QR code, scouted that Tim and saved my... And then called it a day. That was literally my Inazum 11 session. Now, my audio has been acting out really weird. Um, like it just did then. It just muted it. Um, give me a sec, guys. Okay, guys. Uh, we're back after um, actually did a lot of things in the past. <laughs> Uh, two seconds for you guys, but it's been about, um, about an hour for me. That happens sometimes. Um, my mom came home and brought me some food to eat. Yes, it, it was very delicious food. And I fixed my audio. Hooray! <laughs> but, um, yeah, today, like I said, we are going to be fighting Hackerton Junior High. And, um, yeah. I know this is, um, the day that this is going to be on YouTube, the day that Level 99 DLC is released. I'm sorry, but I'm, um,. I am recording this on Wednesday, not Thursday, but I know I'm already going to be pretty busy tomorrow and then on Fridays as well. So the next chance I'm going to have a rec to record is on Saturday. So, um, yeah, sorry about that, but sometimes stuff like this happens. But we're going to have a good time against Hacker Dream because this team was requested a lot. Now, I did actually have my, um, thinger that uh, had the things I would like to talk about, but now I've closed it, so that was really dumb of me. Alrighty, let's, um, okay. Let's, let me open it back up. Hopefully, it does not cut into the screen. Uh, probably did for a second. You guys probably saw that. But, um, hmm, let's see. Oh, these are just my stories. Wow. <laughs> I thought I wrote more on this. <laughs> but, um, no, a topic that I will talk about that I know is uh, currently relevant is the fact that Inazuma 11 is, uh, is now in the eShop. I actually checked on my Australian 3DS and you can actually, um, I can actually purchase the first Inazuma 11 game for like 20 five dollars I think it was, it was 25 dollars 23 something i'm actually very tempted to buy it just for my own uh, nostalgia reasons so that'll be fun but um at the same time i don't i don't really want to <laughs> just because it's something that will waste my time and it's nothing too important so um you know i'm more for me beneficially in one second guys ah sorry about that guy's mom needed me to do something for real quickly and um I did that. Now, now I'm back. But yeah, it's pretty interesting. I was surprised how much people talked about it um, when I read about it. Because honestly, it wasn't a big deal for me that it's been released on eShop. It's, it's true that it like it is a bit interesting that they've decided to do it like that. But at the same time, it makes a lot of sense because um, the Inazuma market isn't strong in any uh, like in uh, any of the Western regions. Well, it is strong in Europe, but it's not really strong in anywhere besides like its strongest point is obviously Japan, and then Europe is like the second strongest point. Other than that, it's not really known to the world, so it does make a lot of sense they put it on the eShop. The thing I like about it though is that it's um, right next to Pokemon Bank, and that gives it a lot of advertising, because Pokemon big franchise and Pokemon Bank is currently one of the biggest things on the uh, in Pokemon related news as of the moment, so it was pretty smart that they um, they were able to get a slot next to Pokemon Bank, so um, that's going to be uh, actually surprisingly promotional in my opinion. 
It's because you got to see it there and it's like, oh, what do you know? What's this in Zoom 11? Then we'll look into it. People will either go, hey, I really like this. We'll download it. And, um, or they'll just ignore it. So it's one of the two things that's going to happen. So, uh, it's either going to be really good or really bad. And, uh, hopefully it's really good for our uh, level 5. And hopefully this promotes them to actually make, uh, the other two games DLC. Because if in Zoom 11, oh, well, what's the point? Did we really just lose the first point? I know we scored a point. We scored a point? What have I been doing for the past five minutes? Oh my god. That was just. God. My level of concentration is outstanding. But um, hopefully this encourages them to promote um the other games into the eShop, such as Inism 11 2, uh, Fire Blizzard, um, Fire or Blizzard, one of the two, and um, Inism 11 uh, 3 Challenge to the World. If they put Inism 11 3 on uh, the eShop, I am definitely going to download it, no questions asked. I'm not going to do a walkthrough on it, uh, because it's on the my, uh, Australian series, but I will definitely play the living living crap out of it, because that would be really fun. It was probably, well, it is probably still one of the best games in the Inism 11 series, just because it implemented so many features, such as physical tactics, as well as. Uh, Shot chaining was just pretty damn awesome. I remember I'd always try to get the shot chains off, but then they would be offside and I'd like cry for a few seconds. I remember I had a really awesome moment in the org actually where um I made a chain shot, then um the opposing team uh, counter shot it or um block shot it, then I blocked it with the reset blade and I scored a goal. It was pretty cool how it happened. So uh, I was like, I am so proud of this game. But overall, um I hope the eShop thing does really well for them and I'm and if I do feel like if I do decide to download it, I am go to play it. Yeah, that, that's my logic. If I play, download it, I will play it like a logical person will. Yes. The only thing that sucks for me is that um I can't necessarily download. Oh, nice! God hand fully evolved. Oh my god, this is great. See, failing does get you places. It evolves your god hand. Sweet. But um, what was I gonna say now? I made, that made me forget. Damn you, god hand. And that was actually cool that Yuki scored pentacles. And now that I thought about it, you know what? I'm not. I'm not letting them score a point this time. They, they made a fool of me once. Shame on you. Shame on you. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, it was like that awkward sounds like I felt like I should say something, but I'm not. Instead, they're gonna pull the rock of my of my Kamehameha wave of my. Ooh, this is like if I ultimate evolve this move, I can have like God Kamehameha. But instead of Kamehameha, hey, yep, that's pretty awesome. That that's actually cool. I, I feel like Kamehameha. It's like codename the Super Kamehameha wave. Yes. Anyway, nothing beats the Kamehameha. Yeah, 3-1, we're looking good. We are looking good. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Alrighty. So I wanted to try, I was, I wanted to try this last time, but I wanted to reflect a shot with the Kamehameha way. We went to go the other way. Let's give uh, Yuki a path straight to the girl. Let's see if we can deflect uh, anything with the uh, Kamehameha. That'll be cool. Yeah. But um, I wonder if, um, because they're doing this with the... Uh, in Azuma 11, I want to, with um, level 5 putting games in the eShop, I wonder if they can put any other games in the eShop, because there's a lot of cool titles that I would like to see on the eShop, that would be cool, but um, at the same time, they might not, like, actually, now that I think about what, what games am I thinking of, and oh no, oh no, the Kamehameha Wave failed against Asuka Road, sorry, we'll have another chance in the future, maybe if I combine it with Iron Zelts and deflect it then, then, maybe it'll work, doesn't matter, let's just sort through the field here, this speed is unmatchable. Actually, it's probably matchable, but still, I like to be really fast. Come in Latin. <laughs> and, um, yeah, I actually can't think of any uh, 3DS games in level 5, or just games in general in level 5. I'll be putting the eShop. Actually, no, the cool thing about it being on the eShop is that it's got the graphics of the uh, Endemon Redemption 2 games. That's gonna be really cool how the Hizzle Holds is gonna be a uh, really good quality in that. I'll, that's gonna be, that, that's what was beginning of the put on. A good example on it. What would be really cool if they could like remake all the games with like the Go graphics? That would be extremely cool. If they did something like that, I would definitely buy it, hands down. That would be so cool. Like being able to play like an Ism level uh, one with these graphics, that would be really cool. That would, that would be good. Level 5, they need to do it. They, it's a must. <laughs> Make some Ism level game and just do it for the first one. That's what they have to do. <laughs> oh, that would, that would never work. Uh, still, it's a fun idea, and that is the end of the first half. Huh. We are winning by quite the sum of points, indeed. Alrighty, um, let's let's just own these guys now. Don't have much else to talk about. So these guys gets the punishment of getting owned. Yes, that punishment of getting owned. Right. Um, white blade the three. Bam. 
nothing, nothing too exciting. Actually, <gasps> I can maybe come in, how many, 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 how to, uh, I don't know, I need to try and get Zanon Guru from the girl and have a, I still need to ult an Evolve Sprint War. Huh. Well, that happened, alrighty. No, I'll, I'll, so, yeah, guys, I step A2. You know, I should probably teach him the goat one. The one how it has the goat. Oh my god. Okay, I'll pass it, run away. Timmer, I get it, you really want the ball, but at the same time, we're trying to deflect the shot with the Kamehameha. Enough said, get out of my face. Get out of my face. Alright, yeah, wait, what? Oh my god, I am. My attention span sometimes, I make dumb mistakes all the time. Alrighty, Yukimura, just get past us real quickly, please. Thank you. Thank you for doing your job, which is owning us. And he even got lucky as well. He's he's doing a good job, I must admit that. He's doing very nice. Alrighty. Zen up blue. See if you can pass the ultimate. You guys seem to like it when I did that ultimate test up, even though I was just mucking around and what? Oh my god, I oh my god. I forgot Yuki learned this move from level up. Is that is that a challenge? Oh, he is. Oh my God, this is this is where stuff gets real. No one beats the Kamehameha of the Black Dawn. Nuh uh Prepare to get owned, good stuff. Ah, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my, oh my God. This is. Oh my God. This is the Super Kamehameha wave at its, its ultimate power. Oh my God, that was ridiculous. I beat that, yeah. I'm gonna change the crap out of it now. Uh, if this goes in, I'll be extremely happy. That will be. That is awesome. That's the highest power I've gotten without using a uh, using Grand Master or a Kishin. It's pretty cool. It did help. We got lucky as well. And <gasps> I can change shit with Hacker. Oh my god! This is like the ultimate shit chain of awesomeness. Jeez, this is going to be, going to be awesome. Power of teamwork. Now Hacker just has to score now. Zuri doesn't have a shit chain, unfortunately. Now they're going for a, this is just an attempt battle right now. This is just like they're trying this stuff to come in on me. Oh, and oh god. They even got a lucky and that can really change the power from it. Still going to go. Still going. Still going strong. Oh my god, this is taking so long. <laughs> and oh, they got unlucky that time. Is that is that like us unlucky or them getting? I don't, I don't know. But damn, this is still pretty powerful. And this is like from halfway. This is a, no, not halfway. Full court shot. No, nice try. You cannot beat the Kamehameha. Oh my god. <gasps> Jesus. <laughs> they failed the test. Oh my god. That was. That was ridiculous. So many levels. Good job, Zeno. You deflected Black Dawn day 3 and then you just not holding back whatsoever. <laughs> oh, that is just pure awesomeness there, right there. That's, that's how you get a good, good shot going on. What you do? You, you taunt the other team to make a powerful shot, then you like use the Kamehameha and it, it brings success every time. Like, everyone knows you can't stop the Kamehameha. It's too powerful. Indeed, alrighty, and let's just make pro plays here. That was actually a really good pass. Damn, I I am just so good at this game. I, I even impress myself. Not, not to be cocky or anything, but I'm just professionalism in its finest. Here we go. Damn. I felt like I should have said that I just didn't, didn't feel like it though. But anyway, there's no way this girl keeps this blocking this shot. No chance. No chance at all. Bam. These guys are not failing. Passing the they're failing, they're not failing that much. It's only 6 1. Only. No, it's only. Got it, look in the positives. Yeah. Alrighty. Hmm. Let's see if we can do any other fancy stuff. Um, what fancy things can we do today? Let's see, let's look around. We've got Hillary Flail, Shinto, Vanity Vamp. Hmm, Vanity Vamp. It's a good idea, actually. Let's bring the ball up with Vanity Vamp and score with her. Not him, sorry, God. Yeah. Anyway, here we go. Shin Shadow Dance. This move's pretty cool. Pretty damn cool move. And it actually used to be an Earth Attribute move. They changed it to um, changed it to a uh, Dark Attribute. Ah, uh, is it uh, in this game? Which makes a lot of sense. Sense? Yeah, sense. No. Ah, uh, because Void um, the Void Elements are meant to represent Shadow, and then the move is called Shadow Dance. So it makes a lot of sense that it's, it's like the Void Element is it all. Anyway, um, let's bring the ball up a bit more, a bit more, and pass the Venefy. Uh, what moves do you have, Venefy Vamp? Um. I taught you all your moves. You have, uh, I think I gave you Heaven's Drive, and now I know you have, uh, what do you want to call it? This is a total of, uh, Vampire Lord Zay. It's not even that powerful whatsoever, just because I haven't trained your stats at all, remotely, and, um, 
Yeah. Yep, I am. I just, I'm just, I'm literally like, as I'm recording this, I'm like, I feel like, I feel very unprofessional right now. I'm literally looking at my text while recording. That's what we call multitasking like a pro. Oh, that is, that is great. <laughs> Guys, if you want to be a good YouTuber, what you do is that you don't do anything paying attention to the video. Like, before you see, like, I scored a point, did they even notice? Professional, right there. <laughs> okay, um, I damn, Yuki is just, okay, Yuki, we're gonna give you one last chance. If you can 1v1 Shinto, you will, un okay, yeah, I gave you a chance, Yuki. I like, I also like, if you 1v1 Shinto, I'll let you. This is like the true ultimate test here. I'm, I'm letting you get the ball. No, no, okay. Yuki, you have to 1v1 <laughs> There's no way he's passing this test. There's no way. Oh, no way. <laughs> Alrighty. Alrighty, Yuki. Second test. If Shinto scores, you fail. That's, that's the test right now. Shinto is trying to score a point, and oh my god, he's so damn fast. Take slow down speed race. Jesus. Alrighty, let's make past the Shinto. Shinto, do you have a cushion? If you do, you're gonna make my life a whole lot easier. And you have a soul. Alrighty, you let me down, Shinto. This is like the redemption test. If we score, you lose. Oh yeah, this is totally not going to be a goal. Yep. Okay, that was, that was barely though. Mm. I see. I see how you haven't really done that well with your team. You're not you're not satisfying me. Good sir. You guys, you guys really seem to enjoy it when I was being all, all evil and stuff. I can like Xanark and I was like, sweet. Anyway, let's let's show them. Let's show them what we're done for today. We're finishing these guys off. These guys do not deserve my time. Why like everything great three? Send them. Why that is weaker than Benefit Games Vampire. How can we get your act together, good sir? Good sir. Alrighty, damn goal. Nothing can stop us now. No ghost will bring us down. There's nothing left to lose because we win. And if you guys get where that reference is from, you guys are amazing. You guys, if you, whoever leaves a comment about that reference, I will, I will give you a hug, an internet hug. Yes, an internet hug, the greatest kind of hug. No, but seriously, leave a comment if you know where that reference is from. I'll be, I bet you Maurice probably does, but it's Maurice. He knows everything. And um, yeah, that is all for today. Um, really hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, sorry that it's a sort of bit rushed, just because I'm I'm pretty busy. Yeah. First world problems, guys. First world problems. But, um, yeah, cue the outro music, because this is True Pyro Shad, signing out. Peace.